Right, so that, that is the tea drank, the Panaraisin eaten at Coffee One in Bicester. Seems to be my new sort of, uh, my new stop off, you know, that's just where, that's just where I want to go. I shouldn't really have to thank him, but I felt it was polite to, <laughs> because you know when you're at roundabouts and everyone's like stopped off, you're right mate, you know when you're at roundabouts and everyone's stopped because they're waiting, you know, he has right of way, but then you have right of way, but then that guy has right of way, and it's just a forever ending cycle of rights of way. But I decided, I decided I'll go. I'll be the one to uh, to do it, so I thanked him. But yes, coffee one in Bista, go check it out. It's a lovely little coffee shop. He didn't want to give me the way, but it's fine. I'm ahead. Ha ha! <laughs> and he's going to be stuck at the lights. <laughs> oh, win-win. Right then, enough of that silliness. Hello, everyone. How are you? I hope you're all safe. I hope you are all well. Welcome back to the Rhythmic Biker channel. Today's very windy. I don't really understand why, because I thought we were meant to be getting into nicer weather. But I can hear the wind at the moment. And I can feel it against my chest. I couldn't feel it on the way here, so I'm guessing the wind must be coming at me now and must have been behind me. These are some beautiful cars, if you could see them from my head shakes. I'm just going to go around him. Yeah, they are some beautiful cars. Um, so yeah, let's, let's have a chat. It's been a while since we've just had a chat. Let's have a chat. Get yourself a cup of tea or a coffee, get yourself a few bickies, sit down and let's chat. So did anyone catch, it must have been about a month ago now, Stuart Garner, Stuart Garner, the uh, CEO or whatever of Norton, had a, got a suspended sentence for stealing like 11 million pounds or investing 11 million, well, he stole 11 million pounds to invest 11 million pounds um, of, uh, of pension money. Anyone see that? Anyone see that dirty little oh, rat, little snake, Stuart Garner? What an absolute pillock. What an absolute pillock. Ah, oh, it's just, just, that's sad, isn't it? It's just sad because Norton, Norton, every single time Norton tried to rise from the ashes, something else, some bullshit, some absolute bullshit just has to get in the way. I feel sorry for them. Hello, boys. Hope you're having a good day out. If you hadn't noticed, let me just tell you, getting to uh, 500 subscribers is proving insanely difficult. I seem to be one of those like channels where I'll get like 20 in one go and then nothing for a while or I'll get like so I'll get 20 then I'll get nothing for like a week then I'll get two but then I'll lose one then I'll gain one then I'll lose two more and it, it, I'm just going back and forth so I've been flirting now with like 485 uh, for an absolute what feels like an eternity it just feels like I've been on 485 for ages. I really do want to get to 500, and then I'll stop pushing it all down your throats, but uh, I'd like to get to 500. I'd like to think it's gone on now long enough, this race to 500 with Curious Goose. And to be honest, Curious Goose, he's got some interesting, some fantastic videos coming up. Absolute wondrous activities. I won't give anything away, but uh, yeah, he's uh, he's about to, about to release some good stuff, so I need to hit 500 before his channel just races up there and absolutely smanks mine do you know what i mean i just nah nah i don't i don't i don't want it to happen <laughs> i'm competitive god damn it <laughs> tell you what whatever that car is ahead of this ahead of this focus i want to get a closer look look at that look how gorgeous that is it's a bit small but it's gorgeous i hope everybody is uh still enjoying the wolf tales it really is a lot of fun to, to create and uh, be a part of, to bring to you guys. And the guests have been absolutely exceptional. So to everyone who's come on Wolf Tales, thank you so much, because you guys are awesome. And um, to anyone who wants to be on Wolf Tales, just get in contact with me. Leave a comment on the video. Drop me a message on uh, on, on Instagram. Uh, you know, it, it's, not a, it's not a pick and choose kind of thing. You know, obviously we want interesting people in, interesting bikes and whatever have you but yeah you can make it interesting you you can you watch it <laughs> yeah so get in touch get in touch i also just want to say uh about my hooligan riding video with red and esther 
I just wanted to say thank you to anyone who watched that and uh, messaged me. The reason why I'm bringing this up is it's no secret that the video got mixed feedback. Um, I had some people, I had some people who I really like, who I really respect, who I value the opinion of, um, message me and say, like, rhythmic. The the video was, yeah, it was. Oh, I liked this, this, this. Just keep an eye out or watch out for this, this, and this. That's cool. Thank you to, thank you to those people. You know who you are. You know uh, that's fine. There are a lot of people who most of the people I know are obviously a little bit older than me. They've been riding probably a little bit longer than me. Um, I haven't been riding a short time. I've been riding for over 10 years. Uh, pretty much literally, you know, I got my first bike, my first road bike at 16. You know, the youngest you can get on a ped. And I've had bikes ever since. So uh, it's, it's actually 10 years bang on. It's not over 10 years, but whatever. Um, you know, it is, it is what it is. Um, so I'm not the most experienced. You know, there are people that have been riding longer than I've been alive. And I value, I value those guys' opinions to no end. Um, but then there are some others, which is always to be expected, who can't do it that way. They have to criticize, they have to start, start something. And um, yeah, firstly, I just want to apologize if the video wasn't to your taste. Um, and when I say not to your taste, I mean the people who I like and respect. To anyone who I don't know, or who I don't like and who I don't respect, um, I couldn't care less about what you think. So <laughs> if you didn't like it, tough. <laughs> Thanks for the view. Um, but yeah, to anyone like when you get into these confrontations and whatever online, like, don't take no notice of it from me. So I'm sorry if that riled anyone up the wrong way. Again, not to the people it was against. I could care less about you. But just to the people who I like and I trust and I respect. Because that's not obviously the image I want to portray as, like, for myself. But, um, but you gotta, you got to stick up for yourself. Especially when you've got, you know, some false agenda, some fake agenda. You've got some absolute wild accusations being thrown at you. I don't know. It's cool. Big shout out to my friend uh, Verified Squid because he was mature. He said some really sensible things both during the confrontation and um, and to myself personally. He uh, he looked at it from a from a very level-headed approach. And um, he he basically summed it up. Everyone rides to their own ability and to their own style. You can tell people all you want how to ride. Um, if you want to, if that's what if that's what gets you excited, you know, if that's what gets you in the mood, then fine. But um, but not everybody wants to be told. In fact, nobody wants to be told how to ride because it's ridiculous. You know, people are going to ride to how they feel comfortable, how they feel, how they feel safest, or how they have the most fun. It's their bike. It's their license. I get that you might have opinions, but I don't know. I grew up. I grew up with the mentality of. Or being taught the mentality, if you have nothing nice to say, don't say anything at all. So, that's cool. Say it in private, say it to your other rider buddies, but... Yeah, to those of you who are just out there to start a fight on, on Facebook or Instagram like that, your keyboard warriors, you, you're ridiculous. <laughs> you just are. So, it's calm. But to anyone else, yeah, my apologies, but I hope you enjoyed the video at least, because... I don't know. I'm not saying sorry for the video because I, I enjoyed making it. I enjoyed editing it and oh, it's funny <laughs> to me anyway. But yeah, I've never told anyone how to ride. I've never said my riding is exceptional. I've never said the words, I am a good rider ever. If you go through some of my old videos, you'll actually hear me say, oh, I couldn't do the I I uh, the I A M stuff because um, because I just don't think I'm at that level. I know they train you to get to that level and that's that's calm, but yeah, I never try and just basically be like, oh yeah, I'm great or whatever. Nah, that ain't, that ain't what I'm about. That is not what I'm about at all. So yes, boys and girls, brothers and sisters, with all of that said, I honestly hope all of you are okay. I hope you all ride well. I hope you all keep it sunny side up, rubber side down, all that jazz. Hey look, it's a Honda PCX. I rode one of those in my uh, in my delivery video, if those remember. But yeah, I hope you all hope you all stay safe. Just ride the way you want to ride. Just ride, be happy. Literally, just ride and be happy. That's all. That's all anyone can ever expect of you. Yeah. 
and um, for those of you who watch the videos comment and all that and support both my channel wolf tales i love you guys so much and um, yeah if you're new please like please comment because i do like hearing from you wasn't quite green yet buddy <laughs> and uh, please do subscribe help me get to 500 please <laughs> i wouldn't beg i wouldn't beg but you're gonna make me beg at this point um yeah, yeah come 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 yeah yeah come Okie dokie, or don't come. Cool, whatever. <laughs> come, come, come. No, don't come. <laughs> whatever. Um, but yeah, please do subscribe. And uh, and yeah, I'll wrap it up here because I'm talking way too much. So guys, thanks so much for watching. Till the next time. Cheers.